most precious hearts of light welcome to our youtube channel 365 days with our blessed mother mary welcome by universal ministry of divine love i'm reverend maria Petrovska, and i'm here to greet all of you on our beautiful pilgrimage to the immaculate heart of our blessed virgin we are here during 360 Five days, following day by day this beautiful vigil, and I greet each and every one of you who are here with me when we have started a special 150 days prayer journey on this January 1st, 2022. Thank you, blessed hearts, to all of you who are still with me. Blessed hearts, today is a day 108 of our vigil. And on this day, we continue to work with the valid flame. We continue with purification of all levels of our being. Today, we will focus on purification of very basement of our being, the base of the spine chakra. This chakra, this area, is related to everything, to all needs of our physical body and this material world, including our health, including our food, the shelter, including flow of money. These kind of things can be blocked when our base of the spine chakra is blocked too. So we use a valid flame to unblock the mighty stream of universal force, the stream of all goodness and our being. We will visualize the most powerful purging violet light burning in the base of the spine chakra. Just close your eyes, take a deep breath. Breathe slowly out, let everything go. And see the most powerful violet flame burning and the lowest part of your back. Imagine the expansion of the violet flame in your lowest chakra. Let it burn, let it consume everything that is not of the light. May the mighty valid flame cleanse, purge, and purify all energies within us, everything that can block the mighty stream of light within our being. Let's take this following mantra for the purification of the base of the spine chakra. My base of the spine chakra is the chakra of violet fire. My base of the spine chakra is the purity Yahweh desires. My base of the spine chakra is the chakra of violet fire. My base of the spine chakra is the purity Yahweh desires. My base of the spine chakra is the chakra of violet fire. My base of the spine chakra is the purity Yahweh desires. Take a deep breath again. Breathe slowly out and see yourself standing in the mighty violet flame. See the violet flame glow all around you now. Imagine beautiful violet light spirals moving from the ground around your whole being, going up and up and up, right above your head. May this powerful movement of the violet light purify the very basement of your being. Let's continue now 
our vigil with the litany to Blessed Mother Mary. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of our Savior, pray for us. Holy Virgin, pray for us. Mother of Christ, pray for us. Mother of Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother Most Pure, pray for us. Mother of Yahushua HaMashiach, Pray for us. Mother of our Savior, pray for us. Virgin most powerful, pray for us. Virgin most merciful, pray for us. Virgin most faithful, pray for us. Mirror of justice, pray for us. Seed of wisdom, pray for us. Cause of our joy, Pray for us. Spiritual vessel, pray for us. Vessel of honor, pray for us. Vessel of devotion, pray for us. Mystical rose, pray for us. House of gold, pray for us. Ark of covenant, pray for us. Gate of heaven, Pray for us, morning star, pray for us, health of the sick, pray for us, comforter of the afflicted, pray for us, help of Yahweh's children, pray for us, queen of the angels, pray for us, queen of all saints, pray for us, queen of Yahweh's people, pray for us. Queen of heaven and earth, pray for us. Queen ascended to Yahweh's heart, pray for us. Queen of the most holy rosary, pray for us. Mother Mary of hundred miracles, pray for us. Amen. Our Father, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, I am. I am thy kingdom come, I am thy will being done. I am on earth, even as I am in heaven. I am giving this day daily bread to all. I am forgiving all life this day even as I am also all life forgiving you. I am leading all men away from temptation. I am delivering all men from every evil condition. I am the kingdom. I am the power. And I am the glory of Yahweh in eternal, immortal manifestation. All this I am. O oh, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, I am. I am thy kingdom come, I am thy will being done. I am on earth, even as I am in heaven. I am giving this day daily bread to all. I am forgiving all life this day even as I am also all life forgiving me. I am leading all men away from temptation. I am delivering all men from every evil condition. I am the kingdom. I am the power. And I am the glory of Yahweh in eternal, immortal manifestation. All this I am. O oh, Father, who art in heaven, 
hallowed be thy name, I am. I am thy kingdom come, I am thy will being done. I am on earth, even as I am in heaven. I am giving this day daily bread to all. I am forgiving all life this day, even as I am also all life forgiving. I am leading all men away from temptation. I am delivering all men from every evil condition. I am the kingdom. I am the power. And I am the glory of Yahweh in eternal, immortal manifestation. All this I am. Let's recite now our oh, Hail Marys. Hail Mary, full of grace, Yahweh is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Yahshua. Holy Mary, Mother of our Savior, pray for us, sons and daughters of Yahweh, now and at the hour of our victory over sin, disease, and death. Hail Mary, full of grace, Yahweh is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Yahshua. Holy Mary, Mother of our Savior, pray for us, sons and daughters of Yahweh, now and at the hour of our victory over sin, disease, and death. Hail Mary, full of grace. Yahweh is with thee, blessed art thou among them, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Yahshua. Holy Mary, Mother of our Savior, pray for us, sons and daughters of Yahweh, now and at the hour of our victory over sin, disease, and death. Act of consecration over your soul to the Immaculate Heart of Mother Mary. O Blessed Mary, Virgin Most Powerful, and Mother of Mercy, Queen of the Angels, a refuge of all children of Yahweh, we consecrate ourselves to your Immaculate Heart. We consecrate to you our very being, and our whole life, all that we have, all that we love, all that we are. To you we give our bodies, our hearts, and our souls. To your immaculate heart, we consecrate our homes, our families, our countries, and our beloved planet. We desire that all that is in us and around us may belong to you and may share the benefits of your motherly benediction. And may this act of consecration of our souls to your immaculate heart may be truly everlasting. We renew this day at your feet the secret promises of our baptism and our first Holy Communion. We pledge ourselves to profess courageously the truth of our holy faith in the law of the One, our blessed Yahweh, I am that 
I am and to live our lives as the true children of our Father and Mother in Heaven who are submissive to all directions of the living Christ. We pledge ourselves to keep the commandments of El Shaddai and to devote ourselves wholeheartedly to your service. Blessed Mother Mary, use us, beloved Mother, Release your blessings to this world through us and help us to heal, to teach, to support, to guide, blessed children of Yahweh, to the deepest union with the One through your Immaculate Heart. We proclaim the coming of the Kingdom of your adorable Son, Yahushua HaMashiach, in the inner temples of our hearts, in the beating heart of all creation. We proclaim the living presence of the Christ shining brightly in the secret core of every family, every country, and through the whole world, as above, so below, as in heaven, so on earth. Amen. Prayer to Mother Mary to save all children. O Blessed Virgin Mary, Queen of Heaven and Earth, to Thy Immaculate Heart, the channel of all graces, we pray for all children worldwide. In the name of the Most Holy One, I am that I am. We consecrate every living child on our planet to your Immaculate Heart. We bring them all to you, Blessed Mother Mary. We place the precious souls in your loving hands. And we ask you to be the comforting and protecting Mother to all little ones on our planet. May the Shekinah, O Divine Glory, the everlasting mantle of light of Cosmic Virgin, covered now with the invincible shield of protection every child on earth. O Holy Mother, we raise up our voices and we pledge you from the bottom of our hearts to seal all children on earth, included the unborn in your Immaculate Heart. Truly your heart is divine source of goodness that never fails to love, to protect, to heal, and to guide. Seal the little ones on our planet from the wicked satanic forces. Bind the evil at the core of the perverted nature. Paralyze the dark forces wherever they are and the intentions to destroy the secret innocence holiness and purity of children of Yahweh. O Blessed Mother of Salvation, save the lives and the souls of all children on our planet. May your loving maternal protection save them forever from all danger. Keep all children protected from abduction, sexual perversion and abuse, murder, and satanic sacrifice. May all children on our planet find their refuge in your immaculate heart that as an invincible wall of protection surrounds every born and unborn child in this world. May they be protected from all sin. May their virtues and talents expand through your nourishing love. May they grow daily in wisdom and grace. May the core of all goodness that beloved Yahweh have placed in their hearts and the moment of birth shine forth day and night and expand more and more. 
beloved Mother of Salvation, present every living child on earth to thy divine Son, Yahushua, for his ultimate blessing of souls recovering and resurrection. Wash all sorrow and pain, and take away any remembrance of committed misdeeds from their souls. Heal their soul wounds, and make them all whole again. May no one of them perish, but know the everlasting life and love of our Creator. May their souls, minds, and bodies be saved. May they go through life strengthened by your personal guidance and presence. May the Eternal Father always look upon them with delight and see in them the reflection of their immaculate beauty. May the joy of eternal life in Christ never leave their souls, no matter what can happen on their way. May the right hand of Yahweh and the right hand of the Cosmic Virgin remain above the head of every child on earth. And may the presence of Yahweh at the sight of every child block any evil intention against them. And so it will be by the holy grace of the Almighty One and divine intercession of our Blessed Mother Mary. Amen. My dear child, may your soul be nourished by the waves of eternal spring. May the spirit of rejuvenation fall upon you and make all things new. Rejoice, beloved, because the time of healing and resurrection has come unto all people on earth. Mighty fires of blessed Easter are awakened already on this planet, and the living Christ is already on his way to be resurrected by the power of the Holy Spirit. He is here to renew every living being, every single particle of life on earth. This is time of inner transformation, when the new creation will arise and the old things will be transformed into something new. Are you willing to enter this powerful circle of transformation, beloved? Are you willing to become whole and new again? I am here your blessed Mother Mary, and I come to announce to you today that this beautiful Easter time is the perfect time to let go of your old pain, beloved. My dear son Yahushua is standing here in front of you, ready to take away from you the painful records of your past. May you be willing to place into his loving hands all your old pain and sorrow. Just imagine that this happens in this way right now, when you continue to release the heaviness and sadness from your heart. It is your time to be healed, beloved. It is your time to open yourself again to the mighty stream of perfect love. Truly to heal is to touch with love all that you have previously touched with fear. Let go of your fear, my child. Let it go right now. 
when you continue to release your heaviness and inner darkness into the loving hands of the living Christ. See all this darkness that comes out of your being falls down into the hands of your blessed Savior and it turns into the light, 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 light. Be replaced by compassion that flows freely from the heart of our great master of love. Do you see, blessed child, that all your wounds can be healed at once when you open yourself to the miracles of compassionate love? May I remind you, beloved, that the healing is not just about getting better. It is about letting go of everything that isn't you. May you be willing to recognize and accept your true divine nature. May you be willing to let go of everything that is unreal and false in you. My dear child, it is not a secret that this planet is full of damaged souls. Yes, so many people here have been hurt through the ages. In fact, the whole mankind have had to learn a very painful lessons all over again. You see that all people around you are in the continuous process of recovery from some mistakes, loss, abuse, betrayal, injustice, or misfortune. Truly the whole life on this physical level is on a very long journey to recovery. This is a journey that never ends. I will tell you, beloved, that in order to be healed completely, Everyone here on earth must first of all find a way to accept own damage. If you are willing to be healed, you must be ready to move through your pain with a higher degree of self-love, self-compassion and patience. Yes, these three, self-love, Self-compassion and patience for yourself can move mountains. Take your time, my child. Take your time to recognize your wound, to observe your wound, to heal your wound, and to erase your remembrance about it. Don't rush this process. Because every healing needs a proper space. And so you will see that the perfect healing always comes on time. It is never too early and it is never too late. In reality, the healing can be realized only when the soul has found her inner peace. You may wonder, how can you find your inner peace? It is when the soul has learned her life lessons and is ready to detach herself from this lesson that is behind this particular destructive human condition. In reality, any illness, any pain, any sorrow comes with a message. And the most important message of any disaster is this. It tells you that you have forsaken your true divine nature. You have rejected the light within. And you have forgotten how to love this precious being that is you. 
May you forgive yourself for this. May you be willing to change your attitude from constantly criticizing yourself to being more compassionate, more attentive, and more loving for yourself. Focus more on self-forgiveness, my child. Because there is no any other shortcut in your life that is able to restore your inner holiness so quickly. Is it these words? I seal my message now in your heart and soul and mind. And I promise you that the miracles of perfect healing will transform your whole life when you will allow yourself to be healed. And especially when you will allow yourself to be forgiven. I love you dearly and I am always one 